12 vitamins that are best for diabetes. Diabetes is a disease in which the body has trouble regulating blood sugar levels. Because of insulin resistance. Diabetic individuals are at an increased risk of developing neuropathy. Retinopathy, damaged blood vessels that increase the risk of heart attacks and strokes. And permanent kidney damage due to the high levels of sugar and insulin in their blood. Knowing what vitamins and minerals you need to safeguard your body from issues. If you have diabetes or prediabetes is vital. And in today's video, we'll be talking specifically about it. In this video, I refer to antioxidants, minerals, and phytonutrients collectively as vitamins. Just a brief reminder that this video is just intended for educational purposes. If you plan to supplement in addition to your medicine, see your doctor first. 1. Benfotiamine, vitamin B1, benfotiamine. A type of vitamin B1 that is fat soluble is number one on my list. Benfotiamine, 300 mg, can be used twice daily to prevent or repair nerve damage brought on by high blood sugar levels. This is very beneficial for people who experience nerve discomfort, tingling, numbness, eye abnormalities, high blood pressure, or renal issues. In order for the nerve cells to mend and restore themselves, more energy must be produced by the mitochondria, the microscopic energy factories found inside each cell. In addition, it serves as an antioxidant shielding the arterial walls from damage caused by high blood sugar, lowering the risk of artery blockages and heart disease. Foods high in normal vitamin B1, thiamine, such as nutritional yeast, organic pork, wild salmon, flax seeds, and sunflower seeds, are also advised. 2. Potassium Potassium is number 2. Unfortunately, 9 out of 10 people's diets are deficient in potassium. To fulfill your needs, you must consume 4,700 mg of potassium daily at the very least. Additionally, diabetics are even more in need of it. Add this as obtained through consuming berries, some seafood, and leafy green vegetables, avocados, beet tops, bok choy, cabbage, and Brussels sprouts are a few of the richest sources. Since potassium helps your cells absorb more sugar, glucose, and eliminate it from your blood, it is actually the most crucial mineral your body needs. It achieves this by increasing the insulin hormone sensitivity, which helps to regulate your blood sugar levels. You can increase your consumption by taking 1000 mg of potassium citrate powder dissolved in a glass of water twice daily. 3. Alpha lipoic acid is the third form of the compound. If you have diabetic neuropathy, you can take a 600 mg alpha lipoic acid supplement three times day to mend and repair your nerves. German doctors recommend it as a natural antioxidant to lessen symptoms, including discomfort, tingling, and prickling in the hands, feet, and legs. Your nerves receive better blood flow from alpha lipoic acid, which helps to hydrate and protect them from oxidative damage. Additionally, it facilitates the passage of electrical information from your nerves to your brain, as they should, of course. You can also obtain minor quantities of this. Consuming high-quality red meat and organ meats, such as beef liver, can also provide you with this. Beef reared on grassland and cod liver. Please touch the like button, subscribe, and enable all notifications if you found this material beneficial, so that we can keep you informed of new information on nutrition and health. 4. Cod liver oil, extra virgin cod liver oil. You must consume a lot of DHA, omega-3, rich foods. If you want to mend your nerves, blood vessels, and brain, which is a type of omega-3 fatty acid. DHA is the most prevalent fatty acid in the brain, and is used by your body as a building block to create new, healthy neurons and nerve cells. This can be acquired through consuming fatty fish, such as mackerel, sardines, anchovies, and wild salmon. Icelandic virgin cod liver oil, however, is by far the richest natural source, one teaspoon daily. Omega-3 fatty acids have anti-inflammatory properties and will aid in the healing of any areas of edema and inflammation in your body. They also aid in raising insulin sensitivity, which lowers blood sugar levels. 5. Picolinate of chromium. We just need a trace mineral called chromium in levels of 25 to 35 mcg per day in order to get any surplus sugar out of the circulation and into the cells where it belongs. It helps make glucose and insulin more responsive. 
making it one of the greatest supplements to take if you have diabetes. By naturally defending your arteries endothelium layer, you can lessen oxidative harm to your heart, brain, kidneys, and other organs. As the cells are now receiving the energy they require, you will find that you have fewer desires for sweet foods after you start taking this. I'm aware that this movie has a lot of information. So feel free to pause, rewind, and take notes as necessary. Coke 10 Returning to item number 6, Coenzyme Q10. Coenzyme Q10 is a fat-soluble anti-aging molecule, with important health advantages for people with diabetes or cardiovascular disease. The heart, liver, kidneys, lungs, spleen, pancreas, and adrenal glands all contain large amounts of this antioxidant. It performs two crucial functions. Preventing harm to your cell membranes from high blood sugar levels. And ensuring that your cells have a proper electrical current. So they can continue to produce energy. In fact, the body's cells all require Coke 10 for energy. Diabetes results in blood sugar levels, glucose, that are higher than the mitochondria can tolerate, which damages and oxidizes cells throughout the body. You can daily consume 300 mg of Coke 10 in the ubiquinol form to aid with cell defense. Additionally, consuming organ meats, fatty fish, cauliflower, and broccoli might provide you with this. The crucial B vitamin complex is listed as item number 7 in the B vitamins. We previously talked about how vitamin B1 is necessary to prevent nerve damage when you have diabetes. The B vitamin complex as a whole, especially vitamins B6 and B12, which support the development of the protective sheath around nerves, can be said to do the same, myelin sheath. Although nutritional yeast flakes are the best natural source, Supplements that contain the methylated forms of B vitamins are also available. By regularly consuming these, you can reduce nerve discomfort, increase energy, and keep your brain's neurological system operating normally. Solvent fiber I have soluble fiber at number 8. Consuming vegetable fiber supports the growth of the good bacteria in your stomach and digestive system. Then, after becoming energized, these bacteria generate a byproduct called butyrate that lowers insulin resistance. According to a scientific study, type 2 diabetics with diets high in soluble fiber had higher levels of insulin sensitivity, lower blood glucose, and better cholesterol profiles. This is also very beneficial in preventing weight gain and obesity. Chia seeds, avocados, basil seeds, raspberries, asparagus and artichokes are a few excellent sources. You may also buy konjac fiber, glucomannan fiber, in 1000 mg tablets, however. As this product mixes with water to form a gel that supports your digestive system, be sure to drink enough of water when taking them. Following is vitamin D. Did you know that prolonged mental stress can increase blood sugar levels? When we are stressed, our bodies release large amounts of cortisol a hormone that breaks down muscle tissue into sugar to increase our energy. According to some study, chronic stress increases the likelihood of acquiring diabetes and may possibly make the condition worse. This is where vitamin D gets a bad rap. However, vitamin D reduces stress by controlling this cortisol production. Additionally, it aids in the pancreas production of insulin, which in turn controls your blood sugar levels. It has also been demonstrated to elevate mood, reduce inflammation, and boost immunity to infections. Your body produces vitamin D when exposed to sunlight. But it's ideal to take a daily supplement of 10,000 IU of vitamin D3 and 100 mcg of vitamin K2. This large amount shouldn't worry you because 10,000 IU are equal to 250 mcg or 1 quarter milligram. 10. Zinc. Patients with diabetes frequently experience blurry vision. The retina and the nerve tissues of the eyes are harmed by high blood sugar levels. However, if you consume the recommended daily amounts of zinc, at least 8 mg for women and 11 mg for men, you may be able to prevent retinopathy. Diabetics are constantly at risk for diabetic necrosis, a kind of tissue loss that typically affects the feet first. However, it has been demonstrated that zinc can help prevent this. By increasing the liver's ability to produce glutathione, the principal antioxidant. 11. Acid Acetic, ACV. Your body may not be able to properly absorb the nutrients from the foods you eat. 
including those that are described in today's video, if you have diabetes. The good news is that apple cider vinegar contains acetic acid, which supports the health of your stomach, and aids in the absorption of these vitamins and minerals. Before each meal, add 1 tablespoon of ACV to a glass of water and sip. Additionally, this supports metabolism, encourages healthy weight reduction, and helps regulate blood sugar levels. 12. Magnesium. Magnesium is a mineral that is involved in hundreds of chemical processes, including the synthesis of DNA and the contraction of your muscles. Over 50% of Americans are thought to not get enough magnesium each day. According to estimates, in diabetic patients, a magnesium deficit can exacerbate insulin resistance. Including more of this in your diet can help you manage your blood sugar levels and fend off new pain pathways. Free of sugar. Unsweetened dark chocolate, avocados, pumpkin seeds, and sunflower seeds are a few of the top food sources. You can also take it as a supplement. Magnesium citrate and magnesium glycinate are two of the best forms. As you can see, there are many potent vitamins and nutrients that you may consume to help shield your body from the negative consequences of high blood sugar and insulin. You can start by eating more of the foods that we discussed in today's video. Since many of these nutrients are already present in the meals that you often eat. Now that you are aware of the foods your body needs to stay healthy. Let's look at some crucial lifestyle recommendations you can make. To assist overcome insulin resistance and diabetes. Avoid foods with added sugar, refined carbs, grains, and flour. Such as bread, pasta, cereal, biscuits, carbonated beverages, and fruit juices. As these all raise your blood sugar levels. Change them out with wholesome proteins and fats like avocados, pastured eggs, extra virgin olive oil, raw coconut oil, and grass-fed meats. Consume 5 to 10 cups of organic, raw, leafy green, cruciferous vegetables every day. Good options include kale, collard greens, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, cabbage, cauliflower, tomatoes, and onions. These are stuffed with live enzymes, soluble fiber, vitamins, and minerals that reduce insulin resistance. Start an intermittent fasting regimen in which you consume all of your daily calories. In a 4-hour window and fast for the following 20 hours. Your cells become more insulin sensitive while you fast. Which helps to regulate blood sugar levels. Take 1-2 to two teaspoons of MCT oil after your first meal if you frequently feel hungry. This oil from coconuts increases blood ketones which nourishes your brain cells and keeps you fuller for longer. Stop using vegetable oils like maize, soy, cottonseed, canola, or margarine. Because they harm cells and the pancreas, these subpar. Highly processed oils are one of the major contributors to diabetes and insulin resistance. Stock up on anti-diabetic herbs and spices like berberine, gymnema, ginger and turmeric. All of these herbal remedies facilitate the production of insulin by your pancreas and enhance the absorption of sugar into your cells as fuel. Additionally, drinking matcha green tea can assist insulin in regulating blood sugar levels. Control your stress levels by finding relaxing activities like daily walks lasting at least 30 minutes in the great outdoors, by turning off cortisol, which may be causing your blood sugar to rise. This will assist in calming the nervous system. Even if you have to take a nap, try to sleep for at least 8 hours per day. This will support hormone normalization and stress management. Consuming more of the nutrients in this video and implementing these 6 easy lifestyle tips will help shield your body against the damaging consequences of diabetes. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel in appreciation.